rolling this strong and we still up in this bitch won't turn down. I'm in my zone, I'm feeling it. Stop blowing my buzz, quit killing me. So buy another round, they try to shut us down by this. say it's okay to do cardio on rest day, rest day and recovery day. So we don't want to waste our energy on lift days doing cardio, but you know, sometimes on the off day is, it's good to do it. And I mean, there's different ways you can do it. You can do hit style cardio, you can do the rowing or like one of the stepping ladders, but hit training is always the way to go when you want to do it. But sometimes, yeah, it's good to get it in. This is probably the first cardio I've done and three years, going on a minute 18, but I'm hoping to break the cycle, Keep it out, we're going to try to get heart rate above 147, we're at 147 right now, I'm going to show it, keep the heart rate at 147 for 30 seconds, and that's when you enter a hit zone, and then we'll slow it down, Take a break, nice and slow. We're gonna rest for 30 seconds now. Let that heart rate fall. Keep it about 70. 100. 70, 80. During the rest period. And then 15 more seconds, we're gonna go hard again. Try to get it back to 145. Here we go. That quickly. Took two seconds to jump from 70 to 145. I'm gonna hold that for again 30 seconds. And this is how you do hit training, guys. You can do hit on anything. You're just going maximum intensity for 30 seconds. As fast as hard as you can. We're only 15 seconds. Okay. Alright. That's basically it, guys. You can do this with anything. You can do it hill running, you can do it bikes, sprints. Anything, you can do push-ups, burpees, guys. Hits can be done anywhere, and it's literally the best way to train cardio to lose weight. So, get on that movement, stop running on the treadmills, and do some hit training. Does that look good? So we're waiting for the back room to open up so we can go in and do some more mobility drills and really get stretched out. That cardio literally just killed me. Like I said, it's probably the first real cardio I've done. In two years, don't do cardio much. Alright, so this right here, for tight shoulders, you're going to brace our arm, lock it, you're going to bend at the knees, and then slowly walk forward while dropping, keeping that arm tight, just creating all the tension so you're leaning up against that arm, really stretching the shoulder right here, come over on this side, over on this side, we're just going to do it right now, give each arm 20 seconds, probably lower it, you feel really stretching right in here. Right in the track. Shoulder region, really loosen that up. Do each arm 20 seconds. And then do both together for 20. Oh, my right arm is a lot tighter than my uh, left. So you can even see it. It's way easier for me to sink on my left side than my right. Right is stuck about here. So we're going to hold that. Slowly push yourself up now. Yeah. This arm. Let it take the weight. We're gonna do that three more times now. Really loosen that shoulder up. We're gonna rehab work. We're gonna do since we just did legs. They're real tight too. 
So the main special we do for those is going to be the goddess pose where we're loosening the hips back up, keeping the spine straight, and coming up to loosen, uh, to loosen up that lower back as well as the hips. And then we can add a little bit of level to resistance with that by using this bar, forcing out, coming up, straight up. And again, now we're doing legs, shoulders, lower back. All that. Just get the blood flowing. Everything loosened up a bit. And then add a level of difficulty behind. Pull it up and hold. Spine straight. Now we're going to come back into the goddess pose. Straight down. Force out. Hold it. 15 seconds. Feel it in the hips, legs, everything's still way sore from yesterday. We're just coming up. Let me do that also three times with the shoulder mobility. Alright, so we got these sweet books right here. Get fit done. I've been writing my workouts in, what I've been eating every day on my intermittent fasts. Or I'll just be filling out my workouts. What's your workouts, your reps, your weight, activity time, uh, notes about the workouts, and you got your lunch, your tracking, your uh, macros, all the good stuff. So it's just really easy to keep organized as opposed to a regular journal. To pray today, but no one's listening anymore. Do I need to fade yeah, away? Real close or stay on this one. laying down on the floor? I want to know if you beat the shoulder that I need. I want to go to take me to Neverland. Every day we're stretching, light work, just getting the blood pumping. Uh, can't stress it enough, guys. Some days you can't go hard every single day. But listen to your body when it starts to get wore out. Take it off day like this, and just go easy. Anxiety taking over me, I can't be the only one left. No. Breaking up on me, I just 